Welcome to the channel where all you got to do is, in this case, uh, deck this old head. So this is a, a Saab 2.1 liter head, which are pretty rare. Um, we got this on the race car many, many years ago. And it got hot. So pretty flat through there. Not so much there. Definitely not there. So this whole thing is very worked. So this is a fifteen thousand kind of falls through. So we're gonna have to do something about that. Every time I use this, I smell ozone. It's probably not normal. It's probably normal. Okay, so I'm ready to mount this thing. No. So before I do this, I'm gonna take a stone. A little WD-40 on there. You know, because it smells good. People don't know this, but you can buy WD-40 cologne. I don't know why you would, but you can. So I'm going to be locating on my, essentially the valve cover surface, which in theory is parallel. So I want to make sure there's no little bump sticking up on this to make it Kitty Wampus. You don't know what Katie Wampus means. You need to go to the children's videos. Alright. So the reason I have this up on one, two, three blocks is because this uh, this cam, uh, it's really the distributor locator, doesn't come off. I could get it off. No real reason to. So with the one, two, three block under there, it clears by fifty thousand or something inches, as good as a mile. So that's how much it clears by. Okay. So now I'm gonna find some bolts and stuff and clamp this guy down. Um, one thing to remember is uh, you can't clamp it from anywhere you want because you got to cut this surface. So you could put toe clamps like in here. You could sometimes you can put it through the spark plug hole. Um, anyway, I haven't decided how I'm gonna do it yet, but we'll figure it out. So I'm just gonna paint this with some Tycom. Back in the olden days, people used to make parts with painting dicom on the parts and then scribing lines and then uh, cotton to the lines. I'm not that old, so uh, I never did it that way. But it makes a pretty good visual representation. This contrast between the shiny aluminum you just machined and this layout die. I'm just going to smear this everywhere, and then we'll sneak up on it, take a couple, about five valve cut at a time probably, and let's see where we are. Dropping the mosquitoes. I do make this in spray bottles, but I don't do that much dicom work, so... Probably just fine. Picasso, I am not. I think it should be okay. I'm 
mosquitoes are starting to act up, so I'm going to turn my little friend on here. Put it on top of a greasy rack. There's no fire inside that. I'll be fine. Alright. Let that dry a little bit. Better when the fire started. Okay, let's get some power. My apologies for this Hitachi inverter. It is very noisy. Just about ready to throw it in the dumpster. Cause yeah, no reason for it. So in here, 700 RPM. Okay, so I did all the rough machining and got it to it probably only needs a half of that old machine. And I re-vacuumed it up. I also this thing took a lot of material off, so I kind of touched up this tool a little bit. See this one? So We'll see how it cuts now. Hopefully it's better. And yeah, there was still like a little bit of a holiday here and a little bit of a holiday there, but I think I found should clean that up. There you have it. It's not perfect, but I got a little aggressive with the roughing tool here, but that's probably a few microns deep. And then you can see this where I did the double pass. You can't feel it though. Again, probably a few ten thousandths of an inch deep. So this head's obviously junk. Um, unfortunately, these these little divots here those don't tell you when the head's junk. That's that's the tertiary datum for when they originally machined this head. So they locate on these three pads and machine this other side and all the other junk, and then they locate off of that and machine this. So these ended up as one would expect, quite parallel. Um, but I'm pretty sure when I measure this head it'll be well out of spec. But I wanted to try my new tool out. Works pretty good once I sharpened it again. And yeah, if anybody wants a 2.1 head that's completely garbage, I got one. Thanks for watching. If you like this content and want more, subscribe, like, and share.